Once you've set up Microsoft 365 Business, you can create a website if you don't already have one. You can create your site using a website hosting company like WordPress or Wix. We'll use GoDaddy because our domain name is already there, which makes it easier to sign in. First, we'll sign in at GoDaddy.com. Select Start Shopping. Then, under Websites and Marketing, choose Start for Free. Enter your industry, the name of your website, then select Continue. Choose a theme to adjust the look of your site. Choose Try New Look, browse the options, and select a theme. Adjust the colors and fonts, and choose Done. To add a section, select Pages and Sections, choose Add Section, choose the section category, then the format you want. Select Add, then adjust your section settings. Return home to add or reorganize sections. For example, move the blog above Subscribe. To add your business logo, select the header menu and choose Edit Section. Select Logo, Upload a Logo, choose Upload, navigate to your logo file, select it, and choose Insert. To customize your contact email, go to your contact info, select your contact form, and change the email to your Microsoft 365 business email address. To add a custom link to your navigation, choose the header, Site Navigation, Add, Link to External Website, and Add a Link Title. For the website URL, we'll enter the address of our Microsoft team. Select Create Link. You can continue to modify the website with text, images, and more. Once you've made all your changes, select Settings to verify your website is connected to your domain name the same one you're using for email on Microsoft 365. Then select Publish to make your website live. Your website is now ready for your employees and your customers.